So today I've put on the gravel tires, going on a bit of a casual weekend sort of stroll and I brought along somebody very, very experienced, somebody I actually have known since the beginning of their life and somebody who I taught how to ride bikes. So super excited to introduce to you. Hi guys! <laughs> What's your name? Uh, my name is Aslan. Whoa. So, is this your first time riding this bike? Uh, no. Where are we going today? We're going to the Stoopy Ride and this is some lovely artwork. Should we get on with it? Ah, uh, yeah. Bye bye guys! This is the strawberry line. Ah! Uh, just getting young Aslan used to cycling a bit more, aren't we? Yeah! Ah! Probably going to be his longest ride today, about 10 miles, but we've got food, haven't we? Yeah, we've got the best food in the world, guys! What nutrition have we got? We have lotus. Yeah, lotus biscuit. I've been on the strawberry line a few times before, but um, usually just en route to Cheddar, where I've, I've taken a wrong turn. It's not great using the road wheels generally because it's quite bumpy, quite muddy, where it's been pretty wet over the past couple of months here in the UK. Not ideal, but did just buy some 38C sort of slick gravel tires, which seem to be coping with it pretty well. Obviously with young Aslan at the moment, who's absolutely killing it, getting those leg strength workouts up, aren't we young man? Yeah! Doing really well. And yeah, just an amazing place to come. Um, I think it's about 10 miles in total. I'm not sure we're going to be able to manage going all the way there and back to Yatton Station today. I think 20 miles for a five-year-old. Are we? Yeah. You want to go all the way? Morning. Um, I think 20 miles is a bit much of a big ask for a five-year-old, but maybe we will. Maybe we will. May have kept the Garmin on whilst uh, we, we got the train from Bristol to, to Yatton. Or, my son is just a cat, a kind of level racer. Uh, hi guys, right there we're just on a bridge. There's a big water on the way, and <laughs> my dad just keep getting the camera, so quite a if you look over there, there's some cars. Well, not me right now. And uh, yeah, so catch up with you guys. <laughs> Quick heads up and thank you to everyone who messaged me regarding the Cycling Change My Life vlog. It was a bit of a heavy one, self-indulgent one. Back to some more light-hearted viewing. Now the weather has started to ease up a bit more, so thank you for everyone who uh, sent me a message and everybody who viewed it. What do you reckon? Mm, I think just stay on the safe side. Stay on the safe side. We've headed back now. So we've done we've done four miles of the strawberry line and got to a point where it's a, a bit of a main well it's a, it's a little a road you've got to follow for about a mile um, and it's uphill and there's no pavement didn't really feel comfortable doing it with him um barely feel comfortable myself are you comfortable you wanted to do it didn't you so yeah slowly heading back but uh Fastly heading back. <laughs> but yeah, Aslan is a good cyclist in the making, aren't you, mate? Yeah, I'm going to be the world's greatest cyclist in the world. So, how are you finding your first proper bike ride? Um, good. My tires just ride about me. I forgot the food during the van. Oh, have we got it? Yeah. 
Are we refueling? Some more petrol for us. Yeah? Okay, you can take a breath when you eat. It's not a competition. <laughs> well, you liked it? Yeah. I think you've done eight or nine miles today. Uh, why not 12 or something? I don't think it's 12. Well, by the time we get home, it will be. <laughs> so, just got back to Bristol. It was a good day riding. He took a little tumble, but he's back stronger than ever. And uh, just on our way home now. My but knee's I... What happened? Knee's yeah, your knees, you've got a little graze, haven't you? But it didn't really hurt you. Train, stop! Grow up.